picked up this gale chopper. There's the processor for it. Uh, it's got the wide hay head on it. And we're just at a consignment sale here. We bought it online, so you never quite know what you're getting into. But we bought her, we own her, we paid for her. So whatever it is, it is, I guess. All right, we're loaded up. Got the flashers on, lights hooked up on the chopper. Everything's chained up. Got flashers on the back, flashers there, flashers are on on the chopper. Hopefully we're able to go to almost three hours home. We'll let you know how it goes. So we bought a different uh, chopper. We've been using that FP230 chopper and we've been having some capacity problems. The main issues were kind of plugging with the corn head. I'm not sure. We maybe had something wrong there. Um, and then just, it, if you pushed it too hard, you'd shear pins uh, when you're chopping hay. So you just kind of had a, probably had about half the capacity as our gale for us. So I know the chopper is wore out. Uh, it just, the paddles it didn't blow great on the back. The knives were getting down there. So we ended up putting it on a consignment sale. We'd paid nine grand for it and we ended up selling it for six uh, a year later. So somebody got a decent deal on it, but they were gonna have to put a little bit of work into it. I know a lot of guys love the FP230s. We did our research before we bought it, but it's an older one, and um, we ended up buying that Gale 1285, and that's a lot bigger chopper, and we've been really, really happy with that so far. enjoyed this video please hit that like button below and if you want to see more videos like this come up in your feed please subscribe to our channel and uh, if you want to find out when our next video comes out every week hit that notification bell below and uh, that'll send you a notification when our next video comes out which we try to send them out every week thanks a lot for learning more about our farm and we sure appreciate it